Hi to Chaco. So, there's a Death Knight. I love this map, guys. It's so beautiful. There's an Archmage, there's a Death Knight. So, pretty standard so far. This map, it has like this beautiful... Look at this. Like, real marsh. marsh. It's like a marsh. Seagull for the win. Uh, where was the seagull? I didn't see it. Oh, there it is. It's an albatross. Militia. Okay. Uh, I mean, Acolyte. Archmage. Uh, we have Blade here. Blade does not always play fast expansion on this map, though. Uh, I think he will go for it. First going for this Renegade Wizard. You drink only, you need to eat too. Eating uh, while streaming is very annoying, though. It's not... <sighs> it's, it's just annoying. Here comes the Death Knight. This Waller Metal takes so much damage. It causes it, but it's not dead yet. But the Death Knight does kill it. 42 XP of this Death Knight. Peasants going back to work. By the way, I did eat Bon Rice Cake today. That was nice. Oh, rice cakes are so nice. It's really well made, Kappa. As beautiful as Chaco Kappa Pride. Wow. That's like the biggest compliment anyone has ever given me, for sure. The Archmage there attacks the Death Knight. De Lord Lightstalker is the Death Knight's name. I mean, that's his title and name, of course. Lord is his title. Lightstalker is his name. He stalks the light. I mean, what a fight here between two skeletons and a footman. Footman does retreat. Does want to take the fight. Archmage is creeping. Gets a gauntlet. Oh, he's doing a one base build, guys. One base build here for, Bla uh, for Blade. He's going to keep. He's building a blacksmith. The Death Knight here scouts. Keep, guys. He scouts it. Person dead. He played fast expansion. Well, not this game, guys. Not this game. A player's forces are under Blade actually is one of the players that uh, plays one base more often than other human players. Well, a lot of human players from Europe uh, play more one base than human players from Asia. 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 Blacksmith. He's going up, guys. Asia. <laughs> Chaco, one, qualifier eight. Are you a vegetarian? Because of the rice thing, I mean. A player's forces are under attack. Uh, no. This Archmage going for this Renegade Wizard. Does he get a second circlet? The circlet is so nice, guys. Let's see if he gets a circlet. He circlet! I guess another circlet! Two circlets now. This Archmage is unkillable. Look at this. 650 hit points. 4.2 armor. He's gonna be surrounded though. Or is he? Is he? The Water Mental can still move. Yeah, and the Footman as well. No, no surround just yet. Oh, this Footman though. He gets surrounded. He doesn't have two circlets. No, he doesn't. Hello. He dies though. The ghoul also dies. And nice coil on that goal. Oh, the Archmage though. Our Archmage is surrounded by the skeleton. No, he's going for the goal. The goal gets a coil. Uh, but the Archmage is safe, guys. Two circles and a gauntlet. He's just not going to die. It's plus 7 strength. That is uh, 175 extra hit points. So without it, he would die to one coil right now. But because he has all this extra strength, he is going to be just fine. He's even just uh, killing ghouls. Kills another ghoul. Skeleton's trying to kill the Archmage, but the Archmage... Uh, well, actually, it might be for... I mean, there's no mana for the coil just yet. Does he... Oh, nice Hermit Crab block. That might be... <laughs> this Hermit Crab block forces the TP on the Archmage. Wow. That Hermit Crab block, so beautiful. What are the metal here? Uh, taking out the Skeleton. And these Skeletons, uh, they're trying to get Footman, but I'm not sure. He's just giving Skeletons. He has one coil, actually, so he could maybe get one Footman. What a game, guys. Footman going back home. Uh, what a new one map, Chaco. This map is Irresistible Mind. Irresistible Mind is a very beautiful map. Quack. Crap MVP. This Footman is dead to the coil. Archmage finishes his creep camp. The Acolyte is still over here, by the way. Level 3 Archmage. Level 3, guys. Now he has 24 strength. The 
The same as the level 1 Mount King. This is a fake death knight. He got strong bolted. He goes down. Poof. Poof. More rifleman. Priest. Okay, rifleman priest with the upgrade. Okay. Now the, my question is, is he going for an attack? And it does look like he's going for... Oh no, he's just creeping this. Is he going for an attack for a, a tier 2 timing push? Or is he going for an expansion? And it seems that he's creeping this. So it seems he's not going for an expansion. It seems like he will go for the tier 2 timing push. And I mean, he gets illusions. He could have been cancelling this one right now if he attacked right now. But he's not. He's not uh, going to cancel that. Now my question for Sheik is... Does he get a Crippler third? Or does he... Does he go Dark Ranger with Destroyers? There's two ways to play against this. Against the Rifleman, uh, this Rifleman stuff. One way is with the Dark Ranger with Destroyers and just get a bunch of Skeletons and kill the Rifleman with the Skeletons. The other way is with Abominations with the Crypt Lord and just Impale and then just let the Abominations kill everything. That's right. Players forces are under attack. Any predictions with who will win this qualifier? Um, let's see. Is it gonna be Blade or Cash? I think. And let's let's go for Cash, guys. I, I think Cash will win. It's Cash, no, but Blade is playing so well recently. But, this, but Blade has a much easier. No, I, I, you know, it's gonna be. I'll go with Cash. Okay. This peasant is he dead? The peasant is dead. Wow. We have a mana potion here on the death knight. This is one more nova. The skeleton is just killing all the peasants. Hello, blade. There's a nova on these peasants. The skeletons are still fighting. What is blade doing? He's going for the counter attack. I don't like this counter attack very much. I mean, what you're going to do? Kill slaughterhouse? But you lose all your peasants. He doesn't have TP. That's why he's going for the counter attack. All these peasants are just dying to some skeletons and the heroes. Actually, they're not all dying. Uh, the arcane tower and the militia do defend. But there's another Nova. There goes another peasant. Death Knight has no more skeletons though. Ah. Okay, maybe this is fine guys. Maybe this is fine actually. Because there's not much defense here. There's a Crypt Lord. Maybe, uh, I mean, losing some militia is just fine. I thought I didn't like it, but I do like it now. The altar went down and the Crypt Lord didn't uh, get out in time. Didn't pop out. Going for an abomination now. Look at this. What do, what do we have for Sheik? Besides his heroes. He can buy an orb, of course. He does buy the orb. And there's still enough peasants here to continue mining. Sure, he, he doesn't have the best uh, income anymore. Especially lumber. I mean, his gold income is the same, of course. But uh, he doesn't need any more lumber. He just needs to win the game here. Both slaughterhouses have been killed. They're all oh, there goes a the priest. Though if she can just hold, maybe he should have played a bit more aggressively. Even played, maybe he should have uh, moved in, go for some of these trigger huts with the shop. However, then the slaughterhouse would still be up, so we would get abominations. Another the priest dies. There goes the crypt. He's rebuilding slaughterhouse in the back. Okay, blade just backs off. They both got hurt a lot, so I'm not sure who's ahead. I mean, Blade is uh, head in supply. But he's behind in expansions, of course. Uh, not in expansions, I mean in attack. There goes a little uh, critter. I wonder, Blade, what is he going to do? Maybe he's going for the expansion right now. Just go over here, build expansion, or over here, that's fine as well. Oh, he's not going for the expansion, guys. Doesn't mean he's going... What, what does it mean? I don't know what it means. Right? Because if he does nothing, she will just come back in the game, right? Oh, he cannot go for an expansion because he lost all his peasants, of course. So he doesn't have any lumber, first of all. Second of all, he doesn't have peasants to build expansion with. Argument is level 4. Sheik here. Going back to the base, gonna kill some more peasants, I think. Second slaughterhouse might be cancelled again. There's destroyer upgrade. Coil Nova. 
Okay, well, the Lich and the Death Knight here, killing some more peasants. There it goes. Uh, now with the orb, of, of course, the peasants are gonna die so much faster. And two statues as well. Death Knight TP's out. Oh, this ghoul is dead. So this other slaughterhouse was cancelled. Uh, I didn't doubt, you know, that wasn't gonna be cancelled, so I didn't, never checked. This, uh, this guy, is he dead? He is dead. The Death Knight... Oh, he, he's so low on hit points, though. But he survives for now. Abomination. Oh, Mountain King takes Nova. He's sick. Do we have a coil for the Abomination? Yeah, nice coil there. The Mountain King, he is uh, 160 more mana. He kills the Abomination. And he's now going for the Lich. The Lich retreats. There's a Stormbolt. Level 2 Stormbolt just hits the Lich from the back. But the coil there. Coil on the on the Lich means that the Lich is still alive. Oh, the statues have what a, what a bad position. 132 Destroyer so he can survive. He drinks some water elementals. Pretty nice, guys. Pretty nice. 21 supply against 48. And there's a Stormbolt on this Lich. There's a coil on the Lich. Can he survive? I don't think so. Seems like this is uh, enough for Blade to just absolutely win the game here. Although the Mount King, pretty low. He has an info potion. He hides. Where's the destroyer? He's over there. The Lich is. Uh, oh, he uses the dust. And the Mount King used the info potion. Of course, the Lich. The Lich is still alive. And I don't know. Maybe. Played overcommitted a little bit. Although it looks like he's super far ahead, but now he's losing units on the retreat. This Mountain King. Oh, is he going to die? Yes, the Mountain King does die. And a bunch of other units die. Uh, Blade just went from 50 supply to 29, guys. In like in like half a minute. He lost like 21 supply or so. Sheik, of course, in the same time also lost like 10 supply or something. But, you know, Sheik still has his heroes. He still can kill more units. Um... Uh, he has five peasants still. There's a skeleton that Sheik is not using that he could eat maybe with a Lich. He's just killing more riflemen. Of course, there's no way to fight his heroes and the towers. I'm not sure what Blade is still trying to fight here. Maybe he thinks he can kill the Lich, but you never can kill the Lich, guys. Not when there's Death Knight around. Not when there's like a shop around and towers and everything, really. So Blade finally retreats. And this game is not over yet. You might say double supply for Blade. Doesn't matter, guys. We have heroes here for Sheik. He, he's gonna Nova something. He's gonna Nova something. But what? It's another skeleton. Okay, the Mount King being built from the altar. Okay. Chaco, do water elementals taste different than normal water? Uh, depends. Depends on the water elemental. Right? Some taste like water. Some taste uh, more like lemonade. Some taste like taco flavored kisses. This is confusing. Well, I mean, Zeppelin. Uh oh, he's gonna kill more peasants. He has a uh, skeleton there. Does not get into the Zeppelin. Sla he does build a second slaughterhouse again. He he's not even using the other one. Peasants dying just for free again. Death Knight's out of mana. Lich has another Nova pretty soon. And he escapes. Oh, can we kill this peasant? Oh, Lich levels up to level 3, guys. Level 3 Lich. So, um, what a game. Sheik just likes to kill peasants. Okay, definitely unloaded. We have uh, soon what matter for another Nova. Unless the Arcane Tower realizes that he should focus the Lich. Arcane Tower not very smart, of course. It's okay, but Blade, Blade told the Arcane Tower to focus the Lich. Mountain King is out. So he's just again... <laughs> okay, same situation. There goes the Arcane Tower. There's no TP though this time for Sheik. So if Sheik wants to defend his base. Well, I guess peasants are dying, guys. Peasant Death Knight's gonna hit level 4 here in a second. Uh, unless he dies to militia, guys. Uh, hello, Sheik! <laughs> Almost died there. Okay, we have Abomination and Meat Wagon here, even. Meat Wagon in the back. This uh, Ecolite takes a bit of damage, he's dead. The Mountain uh, King kills the Abomination, he's also dead. 
Meat Dragon just making everyone sick. And uh, oh, Meat Dragon, does he die? The Meat Dragon is about to die for sure. Meanwhile, this Lich, I mean, and the Death Knight just killing peasants. Nice strong bolt on this Eggline, but he's still alive. The Archmage has to kill him if he wants to kill him. Archmage level 5 now. The Mountain King almost level 4. And these guys, I mean, they're just killing peasants. Another Meat Dragon out here. We have a Destroyer as well. We need... Sheik needs more destroyers, not really meat wagons. I mean, the meat wagons. Yeah, I mean, they're not that great. <laughs> there goes another one. So, this uh, destroyer is still alive. This peasants still alive. This uh, this town hall, Black Citadel. Going down slowly. Nice storm bolt kills a peasant. Destroyer drinks some water. Nice waterage. Peasants here now dying. What a game, guys. Okay, this main is dead. There's two spirit towers, but that's not enough to hold, really. Two spirit towers and a destroyer. Stormbolt on Acolyte. Acolyte is uh, really dead. He dies. The Archmage kills him. His other Acolyte. The last Acolyte will die pretty soon as well. He didn't sneak any Acolytes out. But there's no way he could win a base race anyway. These heroes are not that great at killing bases. They just killed all the peasants. And what he needs to do next is maybe pick off a Mountain King. Pick off an Archmage. Maybe he could win if he does that. I mean, it's going to be difficult, right? It's, it's not like it's easy to pick off an Archmage and a Mountain King. But that's the only chance he has. That, he has a Zeppelin, so he can dodge the Stormbolt. Look, the definite and the Retreat and already Blade Mining. Get an Albatross. Don't even think he has a coil for this destroyer. He needs his coils for the uh, for the heroes, for the units. There, there goes a the priest. Stormbolt on the lich. Oh, well, maybe. Uh, well, he has to use one coil on the lich. Can't lose the lich. There's one priest alive. If he kills the priest, there's no more healing. Drink some water elementals. Nice stormbolt here on the death knight. The Mount king is trying to kill the death knight, which makes sense. You know, he has mana soon for another stormbolt. Nova on the Mount King. There he drinks some more water elementals. Oh, Lich takes a coil. Saves the Stormbolt. GG. She GG's out. And Blade wins the first game, guys. A nice close. I mean, a nice 20 minute game. What a game, guys. Blade wins. He's 1 0 over Sheik. This Acolyte against the Footman. The Footman just killing the Acolyte. The Archmage can help, but no. The Archmage is gonna, you know, not help. This Ogre is going down. He's going to kill the Ogre Warrior. The Ogre Warrior is so dead, guys. You can easily live off half an apple and a tomato per day. Everything else just makes you fat. Kappa. Kappa, uh, Ten Flame Caster here with the circlet. He is almost level 2. He kills the Water Elemental. He's gone, guys. Water Elemental is gone. The Death Knight kills Piggy. Piggy's dead, guys. The Archmage is almost level 2. Almost, guys. Almost, but not quite. Not quite there yet. <laughs> what are you guys saying? I thought Chuckle became a mean person. What? <laughs> Why? Why am I a mean person now? Here comes the Water Mental. He's going north. He's going for the Creep Camp. Here come the Militias. The Militia guys, guys. There's a farm going up. Another Footman going up. Uh, we have two footmen over here, you know. And he's going to creep this creep camp. The footman. Okay, here comes the death knight. He has zero XP still. Zero, absolutely nothing, guys. You can't coil, maybe. Nothing, okay. Uh, he got the peasant, 25 XP for the death knight. But the creep's going to death, uh, going to blade. Crap, the free oh, did he get the water elemental? Yes, he got a water elemental with the skeletons. Uh, this, uh, the skeleton is going so down. This other one also going down, guys. They are just dead. 
And this water metal. Look at this. Five hit points. This peasant here takes a bit of damage. Oh, water metal does go down. And the arc range with two foot managers to right clicking this fiend. So much damage done to the fiend. And now the death knight. I mean, 67 XP's. 67, but this Ogre Magi is still alive. 92 XP. Ogre Magi, guys. There goes another peasant. We have 92 on the Death Knight now. Of course, it's a little bit less XP for the Archmage Please than 92, but it's like 88 or some. I think 88 for the Archmage. How much hit points? 153. He keeps his coin already and he, he gets it, guys. 184 XP now on the Death Knight. He retreats. He needs to get level 2, though, ASAP. He needs one more kill, anything. Peasant, a creep, a level one creep would be enough. He needs that unholy aura now to regenerate his health and to get some more movement speed. But Blade is not gonna give him the chance. He's not gonna give him the time to get level two on the Death Knight. He has five footmen and one Archmage. And they're on their way. Want to kill shit. Oh, there's a Lich. There's a Slaughterhouse, there's a Ziggurat. Nice coil on the Fiend. We have seven footmen and an archmage. An archmage, seven footmen. What a game, guys. Peasants building this expansion, the town hall going up, scout tower turning into arcane tower. The main is beautiful. He's supply block, so I cannot build a footman. Now we can build a footman. But meanwhile. His death knight, he just wants one kill, remember? One kill. And he's level two. Even a peasant kill would be good enough with the skeletons. Our uh, repl replenishment potion there, I mean, it would be good for the death knight as well, but the archmage will pick it up. For sure. Oh, the death knight gets level two. And over here. Did he kill you? No, not yet. There's a lich. There goes the skeleton. Archmage doesn't have boots, but the footman. Oh, do we have Nova? Oh, nice Nova. All the footmen together. This footman so dead. Ah, killed by little spiders nibbling on his toes. And I mean, one peasant went down here. Skeletons, though. Also gone. So we have three fiends. Does he build more fiends? Or does he build a second slaughterhouse? Um, I don't know yet. I don't know. He's going to do one of the two things, for sure. This peasant here, in trouble. He dies. The peasant is dead. Now this footman, he is in trouble. Is he also going to die? He's also dead. What's in trouble next, guys? This footman, nah, he's fine. He's fine. There's only one tower. One arcane tower is up. This other one is... Uh, oh, Koyo. Oh, this footman, is he dead, guys? The footman is dead. Is he going for the tower, maybe? I mean, there's a healing... Healing uh, regeneration scroll was used here. Student healing in the background. There's a coil on the fiend. No four fiend still. No second slaughterhouse still. Sheik is actually only has 120 lumber. Cannot build a second slaughterhouse yet. But it seems like okay. There it is. Now he did build a second slaughterhouse already when I checked his lumber. So this is a build that Happy likes to do. We always, almost always, see Happy do this exact build. Three fiends into double slaughterhouse. It's the second slaughterhouse. Usually, it's slightly bit earlier though. Death knight is beautiful. This footman is he dead? He's dead. Two statues. Okay. Okay. What are the water men going for? For the statues. Okay, they want to snipe a statue. Archmage, why is he not level 3 yet? Oh, he needs 9 more XP, that's why. 9 more XP, guys. There's a blacksmith going up. Imagine if these water elementals were level 2. They would be sniping the statues so easily. No, they're just level 1. They're just useless level 1 water elementals. Hello. Let's watch some 3 vs 3s next Monday, guys. Next Monday, we have a 3 vs 3 hype match. Um, this is going to be so much hype. So nice. This water mental is. What's he attacking here exactly? He's going for the statue. Of course, always. Always go for the statue. Do we get destroyers yet? Where are. Where's the destroyer? Okay, okay, there it is. Soon, guys. 
soon and do we oh 28 points Players forces are under attack. it was just level one coil is footman is he dead he's dead oh level two lich level two lich <laughs> nine more xp <laughs> this footman here coil oh arc magi arc magi is dead we're tier two now so he could have bought a healing potion he could have just saved the arc mage Easy peasy, look, he's been on tier 2 already for a while. There's a destroyer, so just a pure mistake there. Such a pure mistake. It's been a while since I've seen Blade make a pure mistake. Instead of like a... Like a dirty mistake. Like a... Like a, you know, unclean mistake. This tower is totally... Not... Yeah, I mean, I mean they're both dying. Uh, looks like actually Blade is dying here. These fiends are going home though. These fiends as well. The destroyer is destroying. One destroyer did go down, which is pretty good for Blade, but... Oh, there's a Mountain King! Stormbolt on this ledge, guys. No, on the on the Fiend. But the Fiend survives due to the coil. And this tower goes up, and because he lost that third destroyer, he cannot take out this level 1 Mazer. He uh, upgraded the tower. The Footman, he can't kill the Footman. The Lich, though, is going to have to TP out. The fiend, oh, the Fiend, he wants to TP. He doesn't want the Stormbolt. Doesn't want to get Stormbolt is what I meant. His destroyers, okay, they can still kill some more footmen, maybe. Blade just barely holding on, guys. Just barely. He's getting level 2 Masery. Wow. This peasant is dead. The Mount King is still alive. The Lich here with the orb. Footman is taking so much damage. Whoa. He's dead, guys. Oh, the Mountain King just kills a fiend for free. I'm not even sure if he used the Stormbolt there. He has a healing potion this time. He learned from his mistakes. He used that healing potion. He is still alive, guys. He is still alive. He's going for these towers now before they go up. Um, yeah, I mean, he has one fiend. Two fiends, even. But can he break this? Can she break this? He's going for the tower to sub because there's no peasants nearby to heal it. Also, the destroyers do extra damage against this tower. So the fiends are going for the other towers. This is, a, this is the ultimate damage, uh, you know, by Sheik here. Distribution. Ultimate damage distribution of... Yeah, you guys get my point. One destroyer went down. This fiend... Oh, there's a third destroyer. This destroyer... Is he dead? Yeah, 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 guys, he is dead. He loses another destroyer to towers. There's only one tower left. Does he kill this last tower? There's another destroyer to destroy this last tower. And he does get the last tower. Now the footman dying. But what do we have in the meantime for Blade? Absolutely nothing. Okay. So every, all the peons here have to retreat. They're going to die. The Mountain King has a healing potion. He will survive. He will survive, guys. But we have a level 3 ledge now. Level 3 Mountain King. Uh, Death Knight as well. Mountain King is still level 1. The Archmage is doing just fine. No, he's not going to die. He was just distracting. But the peons, guys, the peasants are all dying. And there is a workshop. There it is, guys. He's on his way to castle. He's halfway to castle. Wah, wah. So. What a game, guys. <laughs> Skeletons killing this town hall. Uh, of course, Sheik is not going to bother killing this town hall with the rest of his army. He's just going to creep. He's just going to creep. A third hero for Sheik. I don't know which one it is yet, but let's check. A panda. A panda for Sheik. He does get one of the wind. Meanwhile, over here, we see Blade as well creeping over here. Level 3 Archmage, level 1 Mount King. What a game. Hello, Argfur. Hello. We have destroyers. So many destroyers, guys. Workshop. Another workshop. A player's forces are under attack. There's some flying machines. Look, flying machines, guys. This ogre warrior is going down. It is completely dead. Close of attack here. Does the Archmage pick it up? No, Mount King picks it up. He will give it... Okay, he gives it to the Archmage. This troll is dead, guys. Go for the next troll. This troll is also dead. Whoa. Nice haircut. Thanks. So much Kappa. So, much so, make sure he kills his peasants that were remade. To, uh, yeah, 
get some more gold. Oh, the peasants are dead. That's a sweet barrel. Almost level two. I was working on this town hall. This destroyer's searching for the human player. Known as Blade. Does he know where he is? Does he have any ID? Does he... Did he scout with some skeletons? Is he gonna, you know, absolutely destroy everything with these destroyers? They're one one upgraded. They find the Archmage, they find the Mount King, but we have trolls now. Twelve Berserkers. They're the perfect counter to the destroyers. Oh, but the first Rosetta Priest dies pretty fast. There's heavy armor, so he dies super duper fast. This Berserker, I mean... The Berserker, is he, you know, gonna Tell die or is he not gonna die? This Archmage is a double claws of attack. Here are the flying attack. machines. They have flag cannon. We have a paladin there as well. They can just easily piece the holy light this berserker. There's no arcane uh, staff of sanctuary though. But the mountain king is flying. He's going for a surround on the mountain king. I mean, doesn't even need to surround. He just blocks him and novas him. I mean, with statues here. Oh, TP out. The mountain king is he gonna survive? Yeah, holy light saves him for now. Nice TP out. And what a nice TP out. And he has already six flying machines, guys. Six flying machines. Can he get more? Yes, of course he can get more. He's building more. Let's see how many he can, he can get. 42 supply against 50. She gets so much money. She can just, just do whatever he wants. Like getting more upgrades. That's what he's doing. Is this Carapace? Yeah. So these guys are now have two armor. And the Panda... It, Panda's not level 3 yet. But he can solo creep the Panda real fast. Get the level 3 Panda. Pretty good against flying machines. We have a knight now. A knight. One knight, guys. He's killing these murlocs. This murloc knight crawler. That's not a knight, but it's a crawler. A knight crawler. So, what's the difference between a knight and a knight crawler? I don't know, guys. It's, it's too much to explain here on stream. It just takes it would take me 20 to 30 minutes the flying machines are one zero upgraded the flying around the stuff panda is finally level three so so chic is ready guys chic is now ready he went up to 60 supply he has more money he can get or oh, even to 70 supply he has the supply available we have played the 50 supply of course he's not gonna win this game but he's gonna try blade is a super player oh Tom IQ no one wants to read it okay I, I don't want to read that either it's just so boring guys that book so boring don't read it Tom of IQ oh expansion hello what item did you get from here by the way I, I didn't even check oh hood of cunning not the greatest item in the world okay well I mean there's two flying machines cloak of flames does definitely pick it up no the list picks it up where are the other flying machines oh here they are they're creeping? This guy's creeping. But he cannot take uh, ground units, so not very efficient. He goes down. They came from behind. Well, everything is just dying here. Uh, Blade went over 50 as well. 55 supply, but can these flying machines win this fight? 1 0 flying machines against 1 or 2 destroyers. He's not getting the second attack upgrade. Uh, the panda is level 3, so the breath of fire. Look at it. Look at it. There! Oh my god! All the flying machines take so much damage. These destroyers now killing the flying machines so fast, so efficiently, so uh, beautifully. The Mountain King also dying here at the center. If you can see him, there he is. He's small, but he's dead. In a moment, at least, he's dead. No, he's not dead. He's the 32 hit points. Breath of Fire. Uh, GG. 1-1 one, one between Sheik and Blade, guys. We're going to the third game. The third game game between blade and chic it's gonna be on a third map of course uh nice graveyard going up two relics going up crypt going up do we see some ghouls yeah there's a ghoul here we see some footman and an archmage wow footman and an archmage footman over here walking Across the map, walking to the bottom right. Guess whose base is here? Yeah, that's Sheik's base. This footman is gonna scout the base of Sheik. You will see the Death Knight. 
Meanwhile, the Archmage here going for this uh, Golden Laboratory. Death Knight's on his way. Footman sees, you know, he sees everything he needs to see. Going for the Acolyte. The Acolyte is just working. I'll let him work. Wow, this Footman, man, he would be fired if he was working in my company. This uh, Rogue here is taking a lot of damage, but the Death Knight steals it. Don't virginity, no one cares. Uh, claws of attack picked up by the Archmage. And his Water Elemental. I can maybe get this bottom elemental. He has uh, more coils. The footman. Oh, he just kills the acolyte. Nah. Yeah. And there's a tank, but he doesn't realize his acolyte is dead. Hello. Sheik, hello. Sheik. Sheik. No, this is so bad. Does he have another acolyte somewhere? A scouting acolyte? Oh, there it is. Okay, maybe he did realize. Whew. Maybe he did realize, guys. His acolyte is gonna mine some gold. Calm down, Chaco. Calm down. Sheik, he, he's in full control, guys. Sheik knows what he's doing. Don't doubt Sheik. I, I bet we don't have a single Sheik doubter in my chat. I'm the only one. I'm the only one that doubted him there. The skeletons want this peasant. This peasant. Oh, this peasant, guys. 31 hit points. His Archmage is creeping this creep camp. Death Knight. He's level 1 still. Okay. Oh, he picked up the Tome of Agility. It's nice. He's now so agile. Look, 13 agility on the Death Knight. Archmage is creeping over here. He's almost level 2. Almost. Level 2. Now he is level 2. The Death Knight with the skeletons against a footman. A player's force is uh, again, we have a one base stack, by the way. <laughs> no expansion. These skeletons getting absolutely killed by the militia guys. Here's a blacksmith. Blacksmith going up. This peasant, you know, this peasant just moving back. No problem. 121 XP now on this Death Knight. The Archmage with his claws of attack plus 6. There's so much damage against this Death Knight. Skeletons have been evaporated. Absol absolutely extinguished. Not a single skeleton left. And there goes the footman. Nice coil. So, uh, 161 XP, 284. Fiendy. Fiendy does retreat. He's building more fiends. So, do we get a similar game as the first game? That would be so amazing, of course. The first game was so nice. With all the peasants dying. Death Knight has coil. It's one coil, guys. One coil. Argument just. Shoot some fireballs at them. The fiend. Okay, he retreats. Okay, one death knight, two fiends. Oh, does he? What is the null doing? The null just wants to be killed by the death knight, it's not by the archmage. That's why you saw him walk south instead of north. I mean, he was gonna die anyway. So it was his own choice. Who do I want to be killed by? A player's force is There's a slaughterhouse going up. Uh, is the lich out yet? Lichy! I don't see any liches. I'm not sure if you guys see any liches, but let me know. There's a Mount King, Arcane Sanctum, a Footman, and a Rifleman. <laughs> a Math of IQ means he's so much smarter now. What a game, guys. What a game. Oh, there's a lich. Picks up a tome again. <laughs> the Death Knight just picks up all the tomes. Unlike the Archmage. Ah, what's that? Ogre Muller picks up a parry up. That's nice. Go for the first troll. These trolls are dying. Does he go for an expansion this game? Level 3 Archmage. Like, I know Sock likes to go for an expansion if he plays the bomb base. Uh, Rifleman is stuff. He likes to go for an expansion around this timing. Blade though, he has no lumber. Six lumber. He just got this upgrade. So he, he didn't... He doesn't have enough peasants to go for an expansion. He has like three, six, eight lumber peasants. He's over Magi is dead. Ring of protection picked up by the mountain. The skeleton scouting. Okay, he's gonna scout. It's Death Knight with the fiends. Creeping, yeah, a lot of beautiful creeping. There's a lich, there's a statue. Guys, we have a statue. 
We have a statue. Kapling a ling a ling. Thanks for the 50 bits medium. The best part of waking up is. Uh, the best part of waking up, comma, is Chaco hosting Cup. Well. Thanks for your beautiful support, medium. The list picks up a pendant of energy. The Death Knight level 3 now with the evil potion. He's killing, uh, you know, these creeps. Oh, militia against a, a skeleton. The skeleton taking so much damage. He's dead. There's a uh, gun upgrade thing for his riflemen. His riflemen are 0 0. Black uh, gunpowder, I think is what it's called, right? Black gunpowder, guys. What is riflemen? Look at that shoot. Well, right now they still have grayish gunpowder. Soon they will have black gunpowder. Two rings of protection here on this uh, Mount King. And a barrier up. And a scroll of the beast. The scroll of the beast could be huge. Because, like, you don't want to build too many destroyers here. You do get the upgrade. Destroyer upgrade. So during the water elementals. Maybe, you know, after you see the destroyer comes in, like there's usually like one, maybe two destroyers. They come in and drink some water elemental. That's when you hit that button. This button. Scroll of the beast button. And then everyone does so much damage and you kill everything. And then by the time the cooldown is done for the destroyers to uh, destroy again, to devour again, you split up some units and you already won the game. Archmage here just plus 18 damage. Hello. Hello, Archmage. Hello. By the way, what build I forgot to check what building it is. It's a random building, so it's different every game. Or it can be different every game. Give the orb to the death knight just to creep this a bit faster. Potion of info. Is there any items you want to buy, maybe? Like, uh... Any item? Could buy. You can buy gloves of haste. Ring of protection plus two. Claws of deck plus six. That's actually pretty good for your lich. All this map of IQ is also pretty good on the lich. Uh, the other items, not that good. Unless you want boots. Like... This has like no good items anyway. You can buy all these items. Sheik still at 41 supply only. Played at 55. But that's of course because Sheik is uh, investing so much into his tech. There's the Crypt Lord. There are the Abominations. There's Slaughter uh, Disease Cloud. And what did we get here? Did he creep this creep? Oh, he crept this creep gun by the way. And he got the Amulet of the Spell Shield. Oh, this Mountain King is unkillable. Unkillable now, guys. Unkillable. Let's see what he gets over here. They just creeping the super creeps. He's using his rifle uh, advantage. Like his bigger army advantage. To just keep the red creep camps and get these super items. Get these superheroes. Then he's gonna push, I think. Or is he going for an expansion? Like what are these militia guys doing? Does he have the lumber? He does have the lumber. Sorceress, did see uh did see Sheik over here. Level three list, level three death knight, but here we have a level four archmage, a level three mountain king with attack. pendant of mana, hello. Five hundred thirty-five mana on this mountain king. He can just storm bolt with the mountain king and then just right click with the archmage and kill anything he wants. Anything. Like even even a death knight. Oh the death knight has info potion, so not the death knight. But this fiend, for example, he storm the fiend, he uh, right clicks the fiend, the fiend is dead. This Oh, nice impel! Look at this Crypt Lord on the left side. And there's a Scroll of the Beast used. There's no Destroyer. You guys see this? You guys see the Destroyer? I, I was saying how good this Scroll is. He's just gonna win the fight, of course. Plus 27 damage on this Archmage. There's another beautiful impel, though. Four Rifemen and a Water Elemental. But this Abomination is going down fast. And there's no more mana for Coil. While this Mountain King has infinite mana with his Pendant of Energy. I mean, mana. This uh, Priest is dead. So, and now he's going for this Rifeman. The... Death Knight coils the Lich, but the Lich has an info potion. He should be fine. There's the info potion. Where is the next Stormbolt going for uh, to? He's, I don't know. I mean, he's so much mana still. I feel like he's not Stormbolting enough. There goes another Abomination. This Rifleman does die. The Kriplord survives, I think. The Death Knight TPs out. The Lich is also fine. And are these guys, uh, you know, chilling? 48 supply gets 46. Look at these bodies. We see actually a lot of human bodies as well. Like one, two, three, four riflemen. Uh, one, two, three priests. Why do I have self vision? Oh, sensor board. Uh, for an abomination. You know, a fiend. Or two. I think there's two fiends. So actually, that went pretty well for Sheik. Even though uh, I thought, you know, 
It's gonna go well for Blade. I feel like Blade could have Storm Brothers more. This Mountain King. At the end of the fight, he still had like 450 mana. I think he only Storm Brothers like twice in that fight. Okay, there's no, no expansion. Come to the militia guys, guys. Here they are. Okay, well, the Archmage is level 5. And the Mount King, you know, level 4. And with, uh, you know, infinite storm bolts. There's an impill. These pets are dying. There's a storm bolt on the abomination. The Driveman takes some damage. He could micro the Driveman if he wants to. Because he's just being killed by this abomination. Coil on the other abomination. And militia dying to skeletons. Oh, the skeletons do get this spell there. And this abomination is dead, guys. The Mount King... Is he? He did get the use the amulet of spell shield. Maybe on Nova or something, or maybe on his, on a coil. This uh, destroyer almost dies, but he survives. Come on, throw us some more storm bolts. This guy's almost full mana. There's a storm bolt finally. And I mean, some bashes would be nice. I mean, it doesn't bash the lich. Meanwhile, precise uh, rifleman also dies here in the background. The info potion was used on the lich. This mountain king has more storm bolts. He's <laughs> He has so much mana. So for Storm Bolt. See Storm Bolt, uh, Abomination and kills it. This Abomination takes a bit of damage. These peasants just standing. Okay, they're fighting. The peasants are fighting now. Another Abomination does go down. Nice bash on the Crypt Lord. The Death Knight is out of mana. The Lich is uh, mana for one more Nova. Crypt Lord has a one more impill and he uses it. Beautiful impill. It's like a lot of footmen. Nova kills the footmen. And do we get another Storm Bolt? There it is. Storm Bolt on the Crypt Lord. He's definitely dead, right? He's a dead Crypt Lord. And it just. This guy is not level 5 yet, but the next Stormbolt, guys. Next Stormbolt. Look how much mana, guys. Hello. 440 mana. There is it. Oh, this is mana for Nova, so the Mount King... Okay, the Spell Shield should save him. Oh, but he... Nova is the footman on purpose, so he can kill the Mount King. Who still would die with like 450 mana. Uh, this Death Knight almost gets surrounded, but, you know, he gets away for now. Yeah, I mean... Killing the Mount King was huge. Now the supplies are even. Who's gonna win this game? Archmage has a TP. Rifeman are 2 0 upgraded. The Rifeman does retreat. Nice round on Mount, uh, the Death Knight. Can he kill the Death Knight? This priest is a very easy kill though. He eats the fiend, kills the priest. Nova. He has level 2 uh, Edith. So he has more Novas now. Oh, Archmage. Nova on the Rifeman. These Rifemen are just dead. We have. Killing the Mount King, I feel like just. Sheik is just killing everything after that. Archmage dies. Maybe GG? Maybe GG, guys. Maybe with the dead Archmage, it's GG. I'm just saying, Blade, you're not gonna win this game anymore. I'm, oh, the Rifeman survived. Clipper is back. Three heroes against zero. Our metal here is gonna fall for sure. Oh, he, he fell, but I think he just expired. Lich is almost level 5. He's gonna re buy one of his heroes over here, the other one over here. Mount King will be back soon. Archmage will be back soon, guys. Blade, he can always make a comeback. You know, he might be behind, but he's not dead, guys. I know some of you already wrote off uh, Blade. He's like, ah, Blade is dead. No, guys. I would never do that for sure. So I don't want you guys to do that either. Because he's gonna make this comeback. This is why we know him as Blade. Blade the, the comeback master. Is what he's gonna be known, now, uh, known as after today of course. We've never really seen him make a beautiful comeback. But today we'll see him make this beautiful comeback. There goes the priest. Nova. There's other priest also dead. Two blood priests. Now the rifleman. He's also dead. Uh, this other rifleman. Is he also dead? He is uh, not dead yet. Well, Mount King back with like, uh, you know, enough mana to cast all the storm bolts he needs, apparently, because uh, with all the. <laughs> in the last battles, we seem hardly cast any storm bolts whatsoever. This uh, abomination does die. Mother Metal in the front, but you know, someone can take him out. She takes him out. Uh, Mount King has a mana for another storm bolt. And what's gonna throw that? Who's gonna throw that? Bo uh, these guys are dying, guys. No, they're still alive. Still alive. This has one more Nova. All these Rifemen, all three together with the Mountain King close by as well. No, he's going for the Archmage. <laughs> GG. 
<laughs> she wins, guys. She's going to the finals. Is she gonna play against Cash? 